Movies in Matthew Alive uh, fans, get ready because please give a warm welcome and a thumbs up to a man who is on the soundtrack, Jose James. What's going on? Thank you so much for being here. He is here, guys. I need some exclamation points. I need some, Jose, uh, how you doing? What's up? Thank you so much for being with us. This is so awesome. Um, you, uh, you've had to suffer through the show, so thanks for, <laughs> thanks for waiting in the wings. I appreciate it. Now, you are on the soundtrack, um, and not only do you have, um, uh, I think we should move over a little bit. Here we go. Let's do this. I want you to get in the shot. All right, everybody, if we can, if we can see them. Uh, they are going crazy. Do you see this? Look. Going crazy. They are, they are literally going crazy for you. Erwin Duckett, Valerie Silva, Lorraine Hoffman, Jasmine Piers, William Monroe, they're screaming at you. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> um, now, you are on, uh, you're on the soundtrack. Yes. You have not one, but you have two songs on, on this soundtrack. How did that go down? And uh, more importantly, what are you singing? I think it was the, the spirit of Frank Sinatra. Honestly, wow! Because these are two songs Frank Sinatra made famous, and we recorded both the songs here in LA at Capitol on his microphone, which I didn't know it was going to happen. I walked in the booth, I saw a little wooden box, and it said Frank on it. And I said, "Is that?" And they said, "Yeah." You're like, "Is there a janitor named you know Frank? I mean? Like, whose whose microphone is that?" Wow! They've been that using is... that same mic since the '50s. That is crazy. What an I mean, were you like dying? I, yeah. I mean, I, the first takes were terrible. I was way too. Oh my god! I have nervous. goosebumps now even thinking about it. It was that. the That's same insane. room and the same microphone that he recorded the originals at Capitol. Whoa! So. That is a crazy movie. It's magic. Matthew Live. Fun fact. That's yeah. awesome. Now, what songs are you singing on the soundtrack? I've got you under my skin, mm -hmm. and. Uh, Oh, what's the other one? They can't take that away from me. Okay, yeah. um, the odds of us and this Facebook amazing comment section just hearing a little bit of that. Hey, Brittany. Oh, he said, <laughs> he said hey, Brittany Renee Roberts. She says, hey, Jose, coming to you from Boston. Brittany Renee Roberts, you just got a shout out from Jose James. Oh my gosh. Um, Could we hear a little yeah. bit of the song? The way you wear your hat, the way you sip your tea, the memory of all that. No, no, they can't take that away from me. No, they can't take that away from me. Oh my God, you guys. Uh, are you dying? They are dying. I mean, they are dying. <laughs> um, everyone is going crazy. Heart emojis coming your way from literally everybody. I love my job, I just have to say that. You are incredible, um, and I've heard you before, but I mean, to have this live, pro I mean, that was pretty cool. Thank this you is, very much. Lot. It's Valentine's. You gotta, exactly. you gotta get people Come excited about give love. People, yes. Fifty Shades Darker, I saw it. I want, you were setting me uh. up perfectly for this next question, so here's the deal. Okay, so not only uh, are you on, on the soundtrack, but you are also in the movie. So you guys, when Amazing. you go to Regal uh, for Valentine's Day and you see Fifty Shades Darker, you will see this man. You were singing in the very highly anticipated masquerade scene, correct? It's incredible. Can you tell us, that without giving anything away, without getting you in trouble and getting tackled by security guards, uh, can you <laughs> tell me a little bit about this scene? Uh, the scene is very, very sexy. It's very, uh, without giving away too much, yeah. it's uh, gorgeous. Everything, I mean, the way James Foley shot the film, it's just totally beautiful. And, you know, I had the honor of singing at this amazing masquerade ball that you've seen in the trailers. And, and it's one of the most highly anticipated scenes uh, for fans. So the fact that you're A on the soundtrack would be in this particular scene. It's pretty crazy. Um, what can fans expect? You saw the movie, so what can fans, uh, Fifty Shades Darker fans, expect without giving anything away from this sequel? It feels really real. It feels very much like in this world. And it's gripping, you know, it's like that you're in the story. Um, there's all the ups and downs of, I don't want to give anything yeah, away, don't, but, don't, don't, don't. you know, like the, of, of the relationship as it develops. And I found it very emotional. Yeah. Of course, it's very sexy. Yeah. Too. Uh, it better be. I mean, with yeah, this, exactly. this movie isn't sexy, we have a problem. <laughs> um, but the first one was so sexy. This one is, it looks so beautiful. And I wonder, when you're filming this movie, now, it, this is, of course, the sequel. So uh, you knew going into this that this is going to be a huge deal. Uh, it's not like this was the first one. You're like, oh, I hope people see it. Like, you <laughs> knew what was going on. What was it like? Walk our movie fans through, like, what it is like filming an actual movie. 
It is a crazy. Yeah. I mean, it's crazy because, you know, it's like if, if I walked out of here and then went to a room. Oh, you're not and, walking out of here, by then, the way. <laughs> That's not happening. Everybody, can I get an amen in the thread? You're not leaving. The doors ever, are shut, like, ever. ever. You're just going to sing for us forever. No, I mean, it's, you know, you're like a normal person, and you walk into a room, and all of a sudden, it's massive and beautiful. And they're like, okay, do your thing. And you look down, and there's Rita Ora, and there's, you know, James Foley, and, yeah. you know, and, and it's like, and there's like, it was like 10 seconds of me just totally freaking out. Wow. Completely. Just like, oh my God. Yeah. And do you, did you sing live? I sang, I sang live, but we also had a recording. Uh, a recording. Yeah. And I had my whole band there wow. without giving away too much. Yeah. It was a big band. And I mean, it was incredible. Oh my God. But everybody was so nice. You know, I got to meet Jamie and hang out and everybody was like, such professionals, so yeah. that really makes it easy. Yeah, of course. Yeah. You met Jamie Dornan, you guys. What? Uh, so I think um, about three hundred <laughs> extras on three. that. I mean, it was it was massive. I tried. They were like, no, massive. just three hundred. I was like, three hundred. <laughs> you guys <laughs> like, no, 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 we're okay. I was like, oh, cool. Um, oh, there's another one. So yeah, a third one. I'm there. Exactly. Um, that's so crazy. Um, so now the premiere. Uh, you went to the premiere last week, yes. and you watched the movie that you're singing in, and then you actually sang at the after party. Were people like, wait a second, wait, you wait, were, yeah, guy. wait, hold on, how, did, yeah, how totally, was that? Totally. And, and can you describe to our fans what it was like to be at the premiere? It was the hottest ticket in town. Um, what was that like for you? Well, first of all, the fans of Fifty Shades are the best fans in the world, seriously. Like, these are some, like, hardcore, dedicated, beautiful people. So, to, you know, to be able to, like, share the film with fans and with the cast and with EL was, like, crazy I mean, yeah. it was amazing and just to be around that energy that love for the the genre that everything was insane and then yeah to perform in front of the people they're like oh my god this is they're in the movie yeah. you know what i mean like so it was it was so cool oh my god to make it full circle i mean i love a party anyway when there's like you know a tray of mozzarella sticks i mean that's a good time <laughs> but then this man is singing like done it's christmas um what song did you sing at the premiere party I sang They Can't Take That Away okay. From Me. And then yeah. the other song on the record was... I've Got You Under My Skin. Can we hear a little bit of that? I've got you under my skin. I need your help. I've got you deep in the heart of me. So deep in my heart that you're really a part of me. I've got you under my skin I'd sacrifice anything come what might for the sake of having you near in spite of the warning voice comes in the night and repeats how it yells in my ear don't you know little fool you never can win use your mentality wake up to reality but each time that I do, just the thought of you makes me stop before I begin. Cause I've got you under my skin. Oh my gosh. Um, everyone is going you heard crazy. it here live, guys. Live, literally live. <laughs> um, wow, uh, that is Fifty Shades of Unbelievable. Thank you Thank so you. much for Thank that. You. My gosh. Um, did you see me fishing? I was like, what's the other song we did it here? <laughs> Anything for you that? guys. I was so course. nervous with the snapping. You did a great job. I'm usually on the one really? or the three, so like, this, was, this was good. The you, two, you're the so, two snaps. You're so, I gave it to you. Uh, you're so incredible, obviously, my gosh. Um, and what an an exciting time for you. You are on one of the biggest soundtracks in recent memory. You are in arguably one of the biggest movies of the year. And um, also, you're on tour right now and you have an album. Would you mind? I think it's over there somewhere. Mm -hmm. It's right here. I have it. He is, his album, guys, Love in a Time of Madness. Uh, yep. That's right. Uh, that's your pose. Uh, see, I could never pose like that, but you, you pull it <laughs> off like it's a good time. Uh, your album, Love in a Time of Madness, uh, comes out when? When does that drop? February 24th. And here is the, the vinyl. And may I say... Wow. Yep, that's good. It's really good. That's good. Uh, that's cool. Are you, is, are you just like, can you believe what's happening? It's a very, very special time. Yeah. I also just had my birthday, so it's like, it's all together. It's all can we get together. a happy birthday in the comments uh, section? <laughs> thank you. Thank you. It's, it's beautiful. I feel like uh, we need more love yeah. right now. We need more 
excitement. Yeah. You know? um, now you're going on tour. Yes. So where are you? Where can people see you across the country? Oh, everywhere. I mean, I'm. I looked a, at your tour schedule yesterday, and he's literally in a new city like every day. Pretty, pretty much, much every and day. You had, like two days off that I saw. I was like, who are you? Like this is crazy. <laughs> I love my fans, man. I love I love to perform. I mean, I'm L.A., Chicago, New York, of course, Boston. I'm going through Europe. I'm going through South America, Mexico City for the first time. Wow. It's going to be awesome. Yeah. yeah. Um, JoseJamesMusic.com. JoseJamesMusic.com has all the tour dates. Uh, and I'm so excited for you. And thank you so, so, so much for coming on uh, our show and giving us a sneak peek of all things Fifty Shades Darker. So and hot. Go see it. Go we'll see it, you guys. Happy Valentine's. Happy Valentine's I'll be Day. There. <laughs> uh, what an honor. Um, I, I, my last question for you is, you know, this is our show. It's Movies in Matthew Live, and we, we don't have a theme song. And since I'm... Ba -ba 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 that was terrible. No, <laughs> no, I liked it a lot. It's not every day I'm sitting next to a famous jazz musician, so I'm like, can we get a theme song that. out of this? Bum, 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 bum. That was better. That's it. Uh, so um, this guy's uh, Jose James. Uh, people are going... Look at that. Look at all the love in the chat room uh, uh, for you right now. Uh, let's see. Um, how cool is that? Megan, Megan Queller just pre-recorded the album. Awesome. Uh, so everyone is giving you mad love. Everybody, see this man Thanks, at Kim, a Regal William. Cinemas. Kim Williams, thank you. Uh, see this man at a Regal Cinemas. Valentine's Day, 50 Shades Darker, coming your way, guys. Now, to see where uh, Jose is playing near you, check him out on josejamesmusic.com and follow him on Twitter at josejamesmusic. Uh, his album, Love in the Time of Madness, uh, comes out uh, February 24th, and you will not be able to miss him when he is singing to you guys at a Regal Cinema doing 50 Shades yes, Darker. Yes. Uh, Jose, thank you for joining us today. What an absolute uh, honor. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you guys for watching with us. We couldn't do this show without you. I'm Matthew Hoffman. Uh, catch me on Twitter at MatthewHoffman1 and on Instagram at MatthewHoffman.tv. I will see you guys next Thursday at 10 o'clock. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. Thank you again for being here. <laughs> That's our theme song. Yes! <laughs>